EA Sports and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live second-round coverage of the Mid-Season Classic. This is when the game is fun, Frank, when you get one high in the air and you have a down breeze and you just watch it stays in the air forever. Be the hang time on that. Here's the second shot from 180. This one has a chance to be close. Frank, how about that? Well, can you believe that, too? I mean, could have hit the flag and bounced away instead. Straight in. Amazing shot. And really deserves it. Action resuming early on the back nine. Let's go to hole number 11. Couple of birdies early in this second round. Frank, what's been the key to the hot start? Just a solid, solid, solid golf. Good rhythm. This is what you're meant to do. Give yourself opportunities. 15 footers. Play the par fives well. The basics of the game. Well, it is nice to have that one in your bag, to be able to hit it that long. Yeah, that has to be at least 315 yards. Oh, this is taken off on a weird line. And it's going to be in the rough, it looks like. Into the tall cabbage, that ball is swallowed up and setting up here in the rough. On the green, and a chance for birdie. Made par yesterday, this one for birdie. You can see why this player has been compared to a young Rory McIlroy. Featured golfer making birdie and now sitting comfortably inside that cut line. 12th hole now, and Frank, the long hitters could have an advantage here. If they want to take a very dangerous line over that left side, uh, this is really where the shot maker has the advantage, that hole bending completely to the left. You'd like to hit a draw there, so use those bunkers down the uh, the through side of the fairway and then just sort of shape that ball towards the green. Interesting shape green, really three different sections to this, and of course three bunkers, each protecting a different portion. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. This could be a good one. Beautiful shot. That is tight. Unbelievable. That is one to save it for the rest of the round. Standing over this putt, concentrating on the read. Good birdie right there, Frank. Oh, time to get another cup of coffee. Things are heating up. On to the 13th, and Frank, I love golf courses where you run into something you've never seen before. I have never played a par five of 700 or more yards. Here it is. There's always advantage of hitting it further than most, Rich, and straighter than most. When you put the two together, it's just straight up a head start. 
Second shot coming up here at the par five. He makes a great pass at the golf ball. It's powerful, but it's rhythmic at the same time. Frank, that ball's sitting up like it's on plush carpeting. Rich, if you and I had lies like that every time, we'd still be playing this game for a living. Well, this one should be safely on deck here. I mean, that's how the game is played, right there. Oh, he's just making it look so easy. That birdie coming up, formality. Birdie putt coming up. A part on this hole yesterday. And with that birdie, he moves into first place. And look in the look at the look in the eyes now. Now at the par 3 14th, over another body of water, Frank, you could make some big numbers on this golf course. I would think if you walk out of here today having shot under par, you have to be really happy. Certainly is big boy golf playing around uh, the cliffs at Lighthouse Point, Rich. And this is another example here at this beefy par three, 240 yards. Uh, you can see Lake Zimmer protects the front of this green and to the right. That's obviously where they get all their irrigation water from. But uh, it's enough green left of the flag here. That's really what you've got to be looking at, that front left section. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Frank, we have said it over and over. Another birdie. The round continues at Lighthouse Point, and Frank, the 15th hole is a par four, only 387 yards. Well, Frank, as we know, golf is not played generally on a flat surface, and here we go, uphill. Yeah, and the uphill lie is going to guarantee you more loft than normal. So you're going to have to counteract that with uh, maybe an extra club. A sensational shot right there, Frank. Oh, you start beating your chest after a shot like that. That's the best we've seen into this hole today. In complete command of his game. Nine under for the tournament with that birdie. Two rounds in the books, Frank, and a good spot from which to make a move. Yeah, well positioned. Uh, really, you know, if you're leading, it's a different pressure. Being in the chaser pack there, playing well, what a great position to go into with two rounds to go.